Have you business to contract with me? Well concluded. Why look, it's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy and yet. Ten times the demon his father was. Fancy seeing you here, can we? Still looking sleek and mean. Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Huh. So... What's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times, they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his plantation, I'll point him out. I would. Is it a Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him. And he'll lead you straight to your prize. Oh, good thing. Despite the waywardness of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment.
Burford, Manning, to me. He's done with this place. I don't. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. It was a good harvest this year. You may not talk so loud, sir. This isn't anything like a friendly port, Ken. Nonsense, man. I had a delightful conversation with a chap just now. We came to quite an understanding. As you see, sir. All up and unfell, boys. We're going home. Captain, you have the look of a man crafting a bold idea. The look I've seen before. You mark well, Ade. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping there. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. I see them. Four! Hold up all the things! Quimmers off the I wing! Them, Enemy unfold mains! Let's move! I know she's a good sailor! Now prove it, my dear! Douse all but mains! I said douse! Douse the four! Hurry! Douse all sail! Loose and swim too! Enemy reinforcements come out! Swim the yard! We're going to hit them! Get the mains free! They are firing, sir! Batten yourselves! He's getting away! I got his cannon! You shot the slow! I'm mine home! Mine home! I see them. Close down, man your sheets. Starboard. Some wrecks cargo adrift here, sir. Fall, fall for all your words! Hello! 
down some sail. Get the sun's out. Let's get moving. Ease off the wind. Ahoy, along. Bring it on. Loose main sails. Tops, gallants, royals. Start. This man's working for Peter Backford's people. Do you know them? The Backfords. Aye. The Beckfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantation, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. But you worked the plantation? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled, or something else? Cane juices. The hard process making sugar. Dangerous. It must be why it fetches such a fair price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers to crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the water. This we did in patches made of copper. Let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin, it stick like wood lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. Get the veins free! Every last scrap of duck on the wind! This man's working for Peter Beckford's people. Do you know them? The Beckfords and their sugar empire. Aye. The Beckfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantations, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. But you worked a plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled? Or something else? Cane juices. The hard process making sugar. Dangerous. Must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers. Crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the water from the sugar. This we did in patches made of copper. But let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin will stick like wood lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackal. Get the mainsails into the wind! Burn the mains! Reef those gallons! such disarray. Bit of a do, sir, that's all. It's Wilmington's birthday. And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We have everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? Whatever for? I believe I was followed here, young man. My Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious.
You up there! Look alive, man! You've a job to do! Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. For God's sake, what the hell is going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? Forgive me, sir. I am fit and able. If I see any strangeness about, you'll hear the bell ringing straight away, I promise. Which of you dogs has the key to the warehouse? Is there no one sober here? Fetch me the warehouse key, if you please. Heavy or not, it's all got to be moved, lad. The key, goddammit! Someone find me the key! Use your knees, lad. I'll not have you through your back. Now, hear no more complaints. You're paid to work. We're not done here, Smith. You can gab later. My advice is to listen. Raise the alarm! Oh. Alarm! Rouse yourselves, you dullards! Stand in me sights! Cut off any retreat! later. Complaints. You're paid to work. Use your knees, lad. I'll not have you through your back. We're not done here, Smith. You can guard later. Heavy or not, it's all got to be moved, lads. With gumption. Use your knees, lad. I'll not have you through your back. We're not done here, Smith. You can guard later. Just get two pounds left. Use your knees, lad. I'll not have you through the pipe. It warms me out. <laughs> These garnishes with poor Latin tribesmen uh, uh, against uh, the enslavement. They're nothing too bloody. Uh, 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 